Finally getting it. Oh, I thought we were going to get this match. And now an attack, an ambush. This is ridiculous. This competitor never saw the attack coming. The official trying to get some help. Come on. Look at this brutality. The issues between these two are so deeply rooted. Can they even go? How can this match even take place? I mean, from the looks of things right now, this superstar is in no condition to compete. Clearly a lot of hostile feelings between these superstars who couldn't even wait for the match to begin before getting their hands on each other. Certainly a very dramatic start to this contest. Just goes to show how intense this match is going to be. Yeah, clearly this fight has been a long time coming, and now there's no more holding back. And a beautiful swan time. Ah, sit out, Matt Slam. Mastermind Bliss with the mind games at work. A nice shot by Alexa Bliss. Ah, oh, look at this. Hair pulled that slam. This is just punishing, disrespectful. Oh, definitely hurts. That was showing great awareness of positioning, placing yourself between the ref and your opponent. She's forced onto the defensive now. And Beth can't stop any offense coming her way. Alexa continues to maintain the advantage. Bringing the focus to the temple, hoping to disorient. Ah, oh, straight forearm. Boom! Put into place. Well, maybe it's just me, but you can only be disrespected so many times like that before you start to develop a complex. You get slapped a lot, Corey? It's none of your business, Cole. Corey, what can you tell us about the transformation of Alexa Bliss? Bliss seems like she's been more focused on inflicting pain and punishment than getting the win. While her abilities have improved, I feel like she's lost sight of her goals. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. All five feet of fury on the attack here. And those punishing abilities of Alexa Bliss on display. Bliss has not lost sight of her goals. A pinpoint kick to the back. What are they going to do here? Leg snap. Oh, the torque on the knee. That's yeah, setting up. Mention a good driver. Alexa gets out of the way. Oh, right across the solar plexus. Well scouted reversal there. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. And Alexa's attack gets intercepted. Oh, colliding with a barricade. Oh. Kidney first into the barricade. Hoisted up. Oh, attacked in the midsection. She's feeling the hurt here. Oh, lifting them up. Sneak eyes! That's it. Turn out the lights. The party's over. And that definitely made solid impact. And now Bliss is in a compromised position. Alexa has to find herself an opening. Bliss turns that around. Alexa might be able to start mounting something here. The U-turn Alexa needed in this match could have been that right there. Beth wasting a bit of time here. Could cost her. Ooh, shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her. Calls the pin off with a rope break. Yielding Phoenix on the attack. Beth's offense is debilitating.
Bliss is seriously out of it. She might be done here. Beth Phoenix, the powerhouse, hoists her up into the glam slam. Alexa's chances are dwindling. This might be one of the greatest rivalries the WWE Universe has ever witnessed. Oh, look who's here on the stage. Some trash talking underway. Are you really that surprised? These two can't stand one another. Looks like this superstar is more than willing to oblige. Oh, here we go. This might blow up before our very eyes. Oh, these two are gonna go at it on the stage. Oh, here we go. Shots exchanged. And now we got officials out here trying to break it up. Trying to maintain some sort of order. Good luck with that. So much disdain. Keep these two apart. Oh, I'm so excited for this matchup, guys. Wait, wait, wait. wait. From behind, from out of the WWE Universe. Oh, look, look out. out. Never saw him coming blindside attack. Uh, how are we supposed to have a fair match now? How can you condone that tactic? Yeah, but now you can pretty much be sure that this competitor is going to be furious after getting attacked from behind. And so there's the bell, but I don't know how much of a match we're in for after that sneaky assault that took place during the entrances. Just overexcited for this match, that's all. They couldn't stand to wait until they actually got in the ring. Or it was a calculated plan to get the advantage. Well, I guess we'll just never know. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. Stomp after stomp after stomp. And repeated impacts like that will weaken you mentally as much as it does physically. Super Slam. human. Talk about intimidation. I'm not sure if it's resilience or stupidity that's going to drive you to try and come back from a move like that. Big forearm. Good golly, Miss Molly. Corey, we know Batista's powerful, but has been a Hollywood star for a number of years. How will his time spent away from WWE affect him? Well, it's difficult to measure the extent of a long layoff. However, with Batista, his training during time away includes Gracie Jiu-Jitsu, so his mat game stayed sharp. So, the better strategy might be to keep distance so the animal doesn't utilize his MMA skill set. Block turns the tide on their offense. Spinning side slam. Big forearm. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex. He's getting a little batter now. What now? Uh, stop right to the gut. Momentum moving towards Batista's corner. The animal is in full force. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. What started out a few short weeks ago with a few choice words has turned into an all-out blood feud between them. This is a level of aggression that few take it to, but when they do, it's all-out war. Spine Buster! Reversal! What a counter! Locks in the gut wrench. Batista getting the WWE Universe riled up. Incredible. Vulgar display of power here. 
Oh, no. my God. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Boom, what a forearm. Into the full Nelson. It's cinched in deep. The official asking him, is he going to tap? Is he going to tap out? He's trying to hold on, but for how long? Full Nelson locked in pretty good here. Oh, look at the power. That's tremendous power. He gets the break. Held in a perilous position. Oh, right to the throat. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. The other end, too. Ooh! Ah, striking with an A. Boom, right across the small of the back. Ooh, I heard a snap. Debilitating attack on the leg. Got him set up. This could be it, Corey. But pitch the bomb! Batista didn't waste time. There's two! He didn't even let the ref start the count. And for all the power that Batista possesses, he just could not keep him down for three. Tossed into the corner. Oh, what a haymaker! And that might have tamed the animal there. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes themselves to. Dominance! Wow. Power slam! Heading up, he's thinking big! Look out! Oh my gosh! So confident is Batista. He thinks he's got this one all sewed up. Great wherewithal on the counter. Oh, check out. Uh-oh. Batista able to counter. And look at for a back suplex. Ooh. Very nice. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. He just barely dodges. He got whipped into that corner. Look at a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this could very well be the beginning of the end. You know what they say, gentlemen? What, what do they say, Corey? What goes up must come crashing down. What a superplex! to the outside. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. Tossing them aside. Counter! And now there's an opening. Caught with a DDT. And he tosses him back in now. Batista stepping up to the top. From the top. Diving elbow drop. Are you Here he goes for the win. Batista did it. What a huge win. Here is your winner. The animal. What a gutsy win. It certainly wasn't easy having to overcome being assaulted earlier with no chance of defending theirself. What a display of courage battling to the win against all odds. A lot of people probably thought that sneak attack sealed their fate, but they surprised us.
The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, CM Punk. This is a match that folks have been clamoring for, and they are excited to finally get it. A man who always considers himself main event material, an uncrowned champion. He wants to show exactly why here tonight. Oh yeah, I like this guy. And his opponent, from Robbinsdale, Minnesota, weighing in at 261 pounds, Mr. Perfect, Kurt Hennig. Now, this is the one competitor I can really get behind. Look how humble and earnest they are, a real warrior for generosity. You need to get your eyes checked. They're totally intolerable. Or is it opposite day again? Yeah, you guys never tell me. If it is, you're good. He has a big match ahead of him. Going to need a career-making performance here tonight. Guys, we have a superstar that is molded to be the next big thing. While he might be molded, he could still use a little refining. If he can harness that potential, we're looking at the next big thing. Sure, a little rough around the edges, Corey, but there's something that comes with time and experience. But he's tasked with quite the challenge in the form of his competitor across the ring. This guy's been tormenting the WWE roster for weeks now. Oh, from the rope! Point of the elbow, nailed it. So much damage inflicted. He deflects it right back. Look out! Slingshot cross body? That was ridiculous. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Look at this. Just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Three. Has the leg trapped. Fisherman suplex. Four. Say good night. Sleeper hold locked in. Oh, just tap out. Just tap out and end this thing. Oh, could be night-night time. No, no, maybe not. What a counter. Big knee to the midsection. Got him in his clutches. Inverted atomic drop. Ooh. He went right into that turnbuckle. Nice monkey flip. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Oh, uh, Ram face first. He thinks he has it. He breaks the ref's count before two. He's still got more left in the tank. Give it a shot. Oh, it's not 
not going to be pretty. Go to sleep, GTS. Night, night. All he has to do is capitalize. And a kick out. No one saw that coming. Not about to go quietly into the night. That took some serious endurance. I'll give you that. And now the question runs in the mind. How am I going to be able to end this? And we've seen how this rivalry has escalated to the point that no one involved cares about the collateral damage they've caused. Hell, Michael, they don't even care about their own well-being. They just want to destroy and embarrass the other. No matter to the sky. What a missile drop kick. Woo. Into the corner now. A little shining wizard action. And the bulldog. Cover. Is it enough? Hard fought victory for this superstar tonight. And oh, look at this oh, with a oh, kendo oh. stick. Are you kidding me? What's the meaning behind this? We'll find out in due time that the message was sent crystal clear. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 236 pounds, Matt Harvey. Here's a competitor who knows the value of respect. At every show, this one asks me how my day is going and even compliments my suit. Wow, a goody two shoes and a liar. What a terrible person. <laughs> One of the founding members of the New World Order. And his opponent, representing the Outsiders from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 280 pounds, the WCW United States Champion, Scott Hall. Scott Hall is a history maker, not just on the microphone, but inside the ring as well. We use the term game changer quite often, but before our eyes is quite literally a man who changed the entire industry. You know, I hate to say it, but Scott Hall actually makes being bad look kind of good. I hate to say this, but occasionally you're right, Saxton. Ha <laughs> ha! One more for the good guy. And a huge opportunity ahead for this superstar here tonight, but also a huge risk. You could say that again. Getting a W over a champion is a good way to raise your stock in a hurry, but taking the loss, well... Yeah, you can probably figure that one out for yourselves at home. Point is, high risk, high reward here tonight. And he's gonna have to deal with the bad guy himself. One of the toughest men on God's green earth. Paul spot demons that would break a lesser man, but against all odds, he's still here. Through the highs and lows, Hall would be the first to tell you, bad times don't last, but bad guys do. It's more than his smarts and his strength that make Hall a tough Chico. It's resilience that makes him special. 
Answering back. Sharp elbow to the gut turns that one around. Powerless position to be in right now. Can't prepare your face for that. Wards off that offense from Hall. There he goes, right into the corner. Face first. And Hall's resilience being put to the test there. And a bulldog. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Kick to the midsection. Twist of fate! Is there anything left in Hall? The cover! How in the world did he kick out there? Holy moly, how? It's almost hard to believe that this epic rivalry began like any other with jealousy and harsh words. But from that seed has blossomed an all-time blood feud. Yeah, and who could have predicted when... Ah, into the ring! From behind! A sneak attack! And Colin for the steel cage oh, to be no. lowered and surround the ring! Nowhere to go. Backfiring in a major way. 